Hey guys, so welcome back to another video here today and again we have the OnePlus 7 Pro here and it is now on the Pixel Experience 12 and right now I'm going to flash the Pixel Experience 13 which is based on Android 13 as you can see the website here, the SDA alright so I'm going to yeah, I'm going to download this file the build here and the recovery image here on the official Pixel Experience website we are link the down link it in the description below alright and because already on the custom ROM so it means that it has an unlock bootloader where I can just flash custom ROM alright so what I need to do is just turn it off to to the bootloader alright there we go and then you have your OnePlus cable connected to your PC or to your laptop. Wait for the phone to boot. All right, as you can see, it's unlocked. So I just plug it in. I put put it on the table. And right now, you have to make sure you have your ADB files and your tools are all installed properly on your on your laptop. And I'll turn on the. PowerShell or a terminal, anything will do. And I'll have two two of these files moved to the platform folder. I mean the ADB folder, so I can flash them easily. Oops. All right, gonna copy the file name. And before we do that, we have to make sure if the device is connected. So you will just type. Fastboot devices. Alright, as you can see, it's over there. So right now we can fastboot boot the pixel recovery. Alright. Sending. As you can see. It's sent to the phone. And we have to wait for a while. Okay, it doesn't, doesn't really work. I'm not so sure why. Maybe we just try to put the recovery mode. Alright, it's booted. So, I think it's because I already have the pixel experience recovery. So, yeah. If you are first time, you have to do this, so it should boot. I'm not too sure, but yeah, right now it booted this. And just apply an update, apply for ADB. Alright, I put it, the phone on the table. And then I found the latest, Pixel Experience 13. Rename the file. And right here, I'll put ADB, site load. Paste the file name, dot zip. And we'll go. Enter it. Alright, it says started. As you can see, the phone right now is flashing. Alright, so we just wait for it to, to be done in just a few minutes. Alright, so why is the reason I'm I'm so fast here? Because it's already I'm already on the Android 12 custom ROM, the Pixel Experience. So please make sure that you are also on the same ROM, or I mean at least you're on the custom ROM, which means you have your book loader unlocked, and then you can only flash the latest Android 13 here, or else you might end up with some boot loop or even your break devices which I'm not responsible for so yeah do bear in mind and make sure you read all the details here on the Pixel Experience website over here you can you can press the install guide here and it will take you to this page so you can read this if, if, it, if it's your first time flashing the ROM please make sure you read all this and follow all the steps here all right so that you do not you do not go wrong 
right and let's go back it's 22 right now let's wait for a while more And yes, one more thing I would like to mention is about this customer right now. It's still on beta, as you can see. All right, it was released two days ago, and it's still in beta, so it might have some bugs or glitches, as mentioned. So yeah, you have to take note of that. As as you can see here, if you are already on the Android thirteen, which was the previous version, you can just dirty flash. So you don't have to wipe it if you are on a previous build and right now 36% 37 38 all right so this is the OnePlus 7 Pro as you can see here it's still a great device to be honest which is very nice it's still fast fluid as long as they are running you are running on the custom run I think because the stock run is just not as good as the custom run I would say because I've tried it all right all right 43 44 Five, six, seven, and yes, the process will stop at for the seven. So yeah, yeah, do not do not panic or worry about it because it's just like that. It will start at for the seven. As you can see here, it says done all right step two done so right now what we need to do is to factory reset everything full factory reset all right this factory reset will also wipe the internal storage so make sure you have backup for everything formatting data and it's done so we are ready to reboot the device right now Go. Right. All right. It says can load Android system, your data may be corrupt already. I really done the reset, so maybe we'll just try one more time. Right. So like even if you did not reset just now, it will take you to this page again, I think. Alright, then you can just reset again. And it shall work this time, hopefully. Yes, let's put that Google logo. So yes, this is the quick installation guide for the Pixel Experience 13 on the OnePlus 7 Pro. If you are on the previous Android 12 based on the customer or any Pixel Experience, all right. Let's wait until it's ready. Put it's very fast. So welcome to your Pixel. Just skip all the steps first and see the settings here. Skip, skip, skip. Right, we are on the home screen right now. So, this is the PC experience, and it's very clean. As you can see, there's no Bloodwares, they are all the Google's apps only. Let's see about phone. 
Android 13 with October security patch. All right. So this is the 13. Number. So yeah, there we go. This is it. And I'll make another video of the Pixel Experience 13 on the OnePlus 7 Pro. So do subscribe my channel and stay tuned for more upcoming videos. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.